Today we're with Princess Birdie, and she's going to show us how to make a a wind chime. A wind chime. Okay, this is step one of the wind chimes, and for this part, you need what do we need um, for step one? We need some uh, scrap paper and so scrap paper, and we need rubber bands and tape. Okay, how many rubber bands do we need? Four. Okay, I have three. I'm gonna grab my fourth. Okay, nice. And, and tape. And then you have tape. Okay. So go ahead and tell us what we need to do. So what you first do is this. You take this and scrunch it up all okay. together. Like this. Yeah. Okay, so you have just one paper scrunch stuff. And then you keep getting more. And you put rubber bands around it. Okay, so how do I do that? Do it this, this is and if it's thing. not tight enough, you can do it around again like this. Oh. And turn it. Okay, so mine's tight enough. Mine is. This is step okay. two. Okay. We're, we're, we are going to paint this ball orange. I want I to do mine a different color too. Oh, you can do multiple colors? Yeah. It would be cool, don't you think? That could be cool. What do you think? If you accidentally mix your colors, it will turn to yucky brown. Mine barely just did, but it's okay. Mine did too. So, it's fine though. You don't have to mix colors every time. Okay. It's just, I'm little, so no offense. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm not little, and I still mix the colors. <laughs> and got yucky brown. Eeks. Okay. So I'm done, so I'm going to put mine here to dry. I'm not done at all. Okay. This time we're not only close. going to paint these one color instead. And it's going to be purple. Okay. So we're painting these, and these are paper towel tubes, right? Yeah, paper towel tubes. That we've recycled. Yeah. Okay, so we paint these. Yep. And you can paint them any color you want, right? Yep, any colors. I think I'm going to do mine purple. This is going to be fun, don't you think? I think this is already fun. Yep. And is this your original idea? Pretty much. Actually, no, I didn't think of the painting you did. Oh. <laughs> no, but is this your, is the wind chime, the recycled wind chime, your original idea? I guess, yeah. How did you come up with that idea? Because I thought of a wind chime, then I looked at these tubes, uh -huh. and, then I, and then I was like, then I thought of that, and I was like, um, oh! And this size. Err, uh, this is hard. Actually, this is a lot easier. And this size. I'm just randomly cutting sizes, is that okay? Yeah, it's totally fine. Okay, and, and I only have... cardboard tubes, and okay. now we're going to make a hole to put the string in. <laughs> so hard! <laughs> Did you do it? I hope. Kind of. There you go. So you may need help to help punch. I cannot do it. Okay, I'll do it. I don't think I can finish this one. There we go. I did it. I don't think there's enough. The chimes. Oh. These to the to the yarn, correct? Yeah. Correct. Okay. Now I'm going to tie this onto the rubber band. Right here. Huh? This? Okay. Did you hear that sound? That was a rubber band. I'm going to tie it on. I didn't really have enough of these tube things, but it's okay. Are you wanting more? Oh, it's fine. Next time, would you use uh, more paper towel rolls? Yep. Okay. Next. But Do you think I, you'll be making this project again? Maybe. Maybe someday. It doesn't work. I think so. I don't know. I'm definitely getting the sound. Do you hear the sound? Like this? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. So, string around the rubber band on top. See? Then we're going to tie the top of it. Okay. Into a knot. Oh, okay, I see how you do it. And mine's done. Uh, mine's mm -hmm. not done yet. Okay. Okay, now mine's done. Okay. 